clocking onto their late shift, Jules is in the driving seat of the unmarked, along with co-pilot Dan, who's already worked up an appetite. I had some muesli and a banana before we run, a bit of chocolate and a digestive biscuit, so that's all I've had today. So we'll be ready for my tea in a bit. Hope you're not too peckish, Dan. Because first on the menu tonight is a dark blue BMW. Hey oh, hey, me. That's got bells and whistles, on not That's going as well, I think. Bells, whistles and obscured number plates. Jules spins on it. It's on the island. Uh, well, what even was it? It was AX3. We're just trying to catch up with one uh, X3. Two occupants, I think it's come out of Tony Lane, you see and it's gone down towards 617 Ireland. No direction of travel, stand by. The speedy X3 driver has already vanished, so Jules and Dan gamble on the first exit and call up the rest of the road crime team. Macro, it's a dark blue, old shape, BMW X3. The number plate's obscured, I think. Dan joined the force straight from school. Two decades later, he's a trained tactical pursuit advisor. And a pro at making the right choice of road. Speed is 100. Zero, zero. Hitting 100 miles an hour, they get the runaway X3 in their sights and use the stealth of the unmarked to tuck into traffic. We have got an A46 southbound towards Lord Chad. Interceptors have one car for cover. Just um, about to come over the river, Mr. Stamper. But it looks like the dodgy driver has already clocked them. He's struggling both lanes. He's definitely seen us. This one's going to go. Sure enough, he's foot down and flying. Committed, committed, southbound on the A46. Just lighting him up now. Stand by. Speed is currently uh, 100. So far, he is failing to stop. But within seconds of making off, the driver is slamming on the brakes in front of an innocent motorist. Now fire. Stand by. He's looking to go contraflow, 846. It's contraflow, 846, back towards Farnden. It's as dangerous as it gets. Two tons of X3 steaming towards oncoming traffic. We have aborted 